think they need to realize that there are reasons why some students find learning hard. Um, and that if we understand the learning process better, then we can, that's the way to improve learning, not by coming up with fancy ideas. In a general sense, um, many people are involved in teaching who wouldn't describe themselves as teachers, um, maybe advertisers or people making a documentary. One of the interesting things is when if you look at good documentaries, they're implementing many of these methods. Um, so they show you a visual image and talk over it. They don't, you know, you watch a documentary, they don't put a whole slide up with all the words on and then read slightly different words. Um, and um, they take you, they often tell you at the beginning what, you know, so and so has been researching this, you know, we're going to the Antarctic to see the, what the whales are doing. And we hope to find out. And, and then after the adverts, they always have a little recap. Um, so, if teachers, um, if people in general knew more about the evidence about learning, mm. they could learn things themselves more easily. For instance, many of us have to do a little something on our computer, you know, something goes wrong mm. and we work out how to fix it. But it doesn't go wrong again until next year. And, and by next year we have to learn it all over again, we've completely forgotten. So if there are things which we want to learn, we, and we know that we have to do some repetitions in the near future. Many people believe I can't do this or I can't do that, but actually they can.